Hi everybody, what we're going to be doing, give her this, Kev, give everybody a wave. Everybody give them a wave. Hey. Right, what we've been doing is like, uh, it's finding out how we can get the team to do at least a thousand pounds volume after the first period, because the volume should get bigger and bigger as it develop their customer base. So this time, Becky Spinks is going first. Fantastic. Right, so we've got um, quite a list, so apologies if you guys have got this as well. Um, first one we came up with was residential homes, so handing out catalogues into residential homes rather than just individual houses, pick the big market. Um, also catalogues to your online customers, make sure every online customer gets a catalogue, but then make sure that you're following them up every four weeks. So just like you go back to your catalogue customer base, you go back to your online base as well. Um, warm market, um, thank you packs, especially at the minute, um, Joan actually, who wasn't in our group, she was in another group, but. Um, using personalised catalogues because um, focusing on you know birthdays, Christmases, christenings, that sort of thing, and they're really small, so they're really good to carry around. Uh, think about the bigger picture, so hairdressers, takeaways, restaurants, that sort of thing. Um, Facebook Live, that's a really big thing for us at the minute. We love doing Facebook Lives, um, and also one that we've um, just sort of named. Me and Laura's just named the Customer Fairy. So what that means is basically we did it last year and then Laura used, did it at Christmas, she said, didn't you? Yeah. It's basically giving one person a, a basket of catalogues and asking them to generate as many orders as they can with them catalogues and they get to keep the commission from them catalogues. And what that does, that shows them that our opportunity works and that they use that commission then for the joining fee so they then sign up from that. Brilliant. That's fine. Brilliant. Um, and marketplace on, on Facebook. That's it from us. Do you refresh the marketplace adverts or? Yeah, go back through them. Every, I think it's every seven days that you can refresh them. Yeah, yeah. Good. good. Mark? Right, well, I think she's covered most of it. To be honest. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, some good ones were uh, when people start, make sure you get the physical catalogues to friends and family. Um, and while you're waiting for the books, to actually make a list of 25 people um, to sort of get them straight out and that usually works to get the welding rewards sorted. Mm -hmm. um, also, um, we came up with, some people say, oh well I haven't got many friends and family. Well then you can go around people that you do know and say, who do you know? And then get them into hairdressers, coffee shops, all sorts <coughs> of businesses. Um, sending people the online links to the iCats and then following them up regularly again, which has just been covered. Um, definitely using Facebook Marketplace, just posting like crazy on there, because that's a great place for getting sales at the moment. Um, give physical catalogues to online orders, even if you post them out, which is fantastic. Um, get friends to add their friends to the group, as a way of getting your group bigger and bigger, to get orders from there. Um, give out complimentary catalogues when dropping off products. Mm -hmm. um, following up the customers online, just like you do with your normal catalogues every four weeks, and sending the iCat links. Um, sending a message on your group saying, I'm just about to place an order, do you need anything? It's a good way of prompting people to get things move, uh, moving. Um, yeah, same thing. Give customers a number of catalogues, and if they generate orders, then get a discount on sales or a starter kit. Facebook Live, just get it done as you open your orders. Do product demos, um, don't be shy about it, just get it done. Taking photos of products as other customers order them are really good for Facebook um, because they, they seem to work better than the stock photos. Um, almost finished. Putting reorder stickers on repeat products just so customers know where to ring when they run out of a product rather than waiting for a catalogue to come through the door. Um, offer bundle discounts. A lot of online shops do buy three and get 10% off or something, so you could try and bulk up your orders that way. And then thank you, packs which have been mentioned, personalised items and collections. Well done. Peter? No, same as him. <laughs> <laughs> I think what we came up with mostly was in the in the. Oh, sorry, I thought. Hey, no. no, he's just joking. Oh, he's got a massive. <laughs> he's got a massive list, Peter. Eleven pages. First five catalogues to friends and family. Uh, Facebook or other message with the link. Oh, sorry, or, or other type of message with link to the online catalogues. Um, if to Facebook friends, etc. If they're local, uh, and also uh, to distant people with the the iCat link, you know the chain link. Also, uh, get group set up uh, with, a, with an invite to all the Facebook friends, to, so that they invite all their Facebook friends to it. Encourage them to buy catalogues, as this works 100%, as the the older catalogue people will know. Uh, encourage people to buy catalogues, particularly if they're only 15 pound for for 50 at the moment. 
You must edit the pictures because that's a big no-no if you don't, we don't do that. Uh, photograph products delivered from cleanies in your box and then post them onto Facebook Marketplace uh, and also onto, um, on, onto wherever you're posting, uh, Facebook, etc. Um, add to your customer base as soon as possible by introducing more catalogs but delivering just 50, 50 catalogs a day rather than having 200 and delivering 200 a day. 50 just takes about 20, 30 minutes. And use real photos. Um, and real photos all, always sell more. And finally, uh, live Facebook presentations. Opening the, uh, the, cake, uh, the clean easy boxes, for example, when you get the first box of delivery. That's ever, uh, open, open it live um, <coughs> through me on Facebook. Uh, if you're not sure about this, uh, there's a suggestion that you practice with your sponsor as well so you get sort of confidence built up. Great. Thank you, Helen. So, I'm not going to give you many online tips really because they've said it all. Um, but I think um, one of the things that we came up with was uh, get people in with catalogues because if you don't, then you're actually removing a string from their bow. So, you know, hashtag do all three. Uh, but when you bring people in on catalogues, give them a strategy so that they know what to do and when to do it. Um, just like if they've got a part time job somewhere. Um, because sometimes people think, because they're thinking about it all the time, they're actually doing something and really they're not. Um, and some people can't organise themselves either. So, And also, uh, what Jenny mentioned was with the uh, people who start on a digital kit, they need a strategy for attacking um, the people that they know with the five catalogues that they get. Um, so pick off the first 20 people that you know, give them to the first five and then the next five and the next five and, ha and make that a continuing strategy for those people. So they've got some tracks to follow basically. Haven't really got anything else to add on to that. Great. Just one thing I've picked up, but I, I don't know. I don't know how to do it at the minute. But when you're taking pictures of the products that come, um, what s somebody said that if you take a, a GIF, which is like a little video of the product, so you're getting it in more than one dimension, it shows higher in the Facebook feed because it's seen as a video. So. Yeah, or I, boomerang. Boomerangs do the same thing. What's boomerangs? Boomerangs. Are, uh, what's boomerang? Yeah, and it's just like it's a repeating thing. So you'll 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 video something and it's just a few seconds. I don't it's not even what is it, five, ten, something like Probably that. Less of less like, oh look at the product and then you you, you post it and it's you going, Oh look at the product, oh yeah. look at the product, oh look at the over and over. Well that's 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 it that's <laughs> a gift. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, like, oh, yeah. oh, you know. Yeah. Well that gets seen more, so I I yeah. I've known that as a gift. So if anybody's watching this, if they can put the the link in there how to do that but, but it's like making your own gif isn't it because yeah. gifs you like you search and you choose that yeah. whatever you want but this is you like doing your own yeah. product yeah. kind of thing yeah though. yeah so that gets seen a lot more so that's a good little tip as well so for the people watching at home if they've got any tips that we've missed if you can just put it in the comments and then we're going to have this a resource video that people who want to get into do much more than a thousand volume they can increase that i mean the top retailers do six or seven thousand and making a full-time income off that i'm not suggesting people do that but it's there if they want to and also obviously we're going to sort of the more money people are making it gives them more confidence to actually grow grow their business so give everybody a massive well done. Thank you very much.